So hey you guys, it's your girl, the Empress 917, and I'm coming to you with another one. You already know. Spirit is in the building. Okay, y'all look. I had a dream last night that was crazy all over the place. I saw rats. I saw um just oh just a lot of karmic stuff. It was it was so demonic, like it was just a lot of karmic stuff. And so I don't really repeat dreams, um, say them out loud unless, you know, they are um, positive. So I don't wanna I don't wanna retell this dream, but I will say this. There is a karmic that has really, really, really tried to manipulate a situation. Um, they're trying to manipulate your children. Um, this person is trying to manipulate everything in your life, maybe even your dream aspect. Um, because the karmic was so much in this dream, it was just like karma activity, karmic activity just going on all throughout the dream from start to finish. Um, I even saw a karmic trying to attack my son, and uh, with 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 um, spiritual uh, with, with energy, you know, and so. Um, you know, if you see your children acting different and things of that nature. But in the dream, I will tell this part. In the dream, I it was a voodoo doll. And I um, crushed it. I crushed it. I crushed the voodoo doll. And I was like, um, my son is protected from all of this energy that's coming toward him. My son is protected from the negative energy. Somebody wants to attack your son. If you have a son that's acting different or something of the name, somebody wants to attack your son. So, I mean, it's real out here. Uh, protection came. Look at that protection. I told, in the dream, I, I was crushing the, the voodoo doll and I was like um, tearing it up. And then all of a sudden in the dream, my son, he was, he was at his, he looked like his younger self instead of his older self right now. Um, so he, he was looking like his little boy boy stage. He's still, he's 14, but he was like at the eight or nine stage year old when he, when he was, when I was crushing this, uh, thing. And then he was like, there's a big rat. There's a big rat right there, mom. And I'm scared. And I was like, don't be scared. And I looked at the rat and I said, um, you cannot have my son. Everything that you have tried to put on my child, he is protected. And then the rat just disappeared. And so, I don't know what that is, y'all. Somebody is sending something to your child, your children, that um, I just feel like it's very negative. They're trying to uh, sway your children and make conflict and confusion within your home all due to somebody that they want to deal with. They are trying to fool with you um, on the energetic level, on the spiritual level. They're trying to fool you, fool your children and everything. Protect your, ch protect your children, protect your child, particularly, particularly the male children. I don't know why they want to do it to the male children. I, I didn't I didn't pick that up in the dream. But make sure you're protecting your children. 333 as I say this. Mind, body, and soul. Protect your children because there's something going on with these comics right now where they're trying to mess with these children. I don't know if they're trying to uh, mind manipulate these children in order to um, treat you a certain type of way. But they are definitely messing with these children. I, I, heard, I just heard a loss of a child. They may have had a loss of a child or something of that case. But they think that because they lost a child, you should lose one too. Oh no, no ma'am, no sir. We're not doing that. Oh, we're not doing that. Yeah, mischief in play. Infinite uh, possibilities. See, somebody is being mischievous and playing with you. They're playing trick or treat. You see what I'm saying? Trick or treat. They are really... And you know what? In my dream, I saw a bowl of candy. So, I don't know. I don't know. But... There are infinite possibilities coming your way, and this person knows this. And so they are trying to mess with your children. Children are on this car dressed up. They're trying to dress your children up as to be somebody else spiritually. Spiritually. Because look at this, look at the back of here. This is your house. They they can't. Oh Lord, and I'm itching. They can't break down your house right now. 
somebody has lost my legs are tingling somebody has lost a job i mean a child and a job maybe and they're trying to play with you and your your they're trying to pull their little puff, puppet strings at this given time but spirit is saying you have infinite you have infinite possibilities you have infinite things that are going on with you 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 creating things through your ancestors and also you are um, the oracle you are the light no matter how they try to play with you look at this light is everywhere <clears throat> okay light is everywhere somebody has a cold heart somebody is cold as ice okay risk and reward okay with this I see that <clears throat> this person took a risk with their heart with somebody who really loved you to be honest with you and this person knew this this person knew how this person felt about you yeah the most magical hour of all yeah they're trying to place magic upon somebody because their heart was broken through this person you see how this heart is bleeding yeah their heart is broken because this person this person knows what they want which is you the karmic knows how this person feels about you so the the the, the only way to get you back is to practice magic this person's practicing magic in the midnight hours um the wee hours of the morning while you're trying to go while you're being sleep in your sleep stage that's probably why i had this dream spirit is trying to let me know there's a rat around or there's a rat that's trying to take control of the situation right now they're trying to sway some opi sway some p opinions and decisions and destinies right now but they can't do it they can't do it because spirit is all over it's in infinite it's infinite possibilities about where you're going in your life yeah because you are the star look at all these stars around that skull you are the star and this person doesn't understand why why are you so healed why are you so protected why 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 creating through ashes yeah this person <sighs> i'm looking at my legs because it feels like something is crawling on me right now um and that's why i look down um whew. this person here this is like you and this is the karmic the karmic has been pretending as if they can grow things and things of that nature but you see how that skull is dark and it's falling apart you know what i'm saying it's like this skull is lo is losing teeth and everything it's like they're trying to create through the things that they it's just broken down over here on this end but this skull is like freshly new and it, it's like they're trying to create through ashes all the things that they but they have burned so many bridges they have done so many things that they can't even create right now then they're trying to break your light down because you have infinite possibilities you take the risk you 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 get the rewards for the risk that you've taken okay yeah authenticity 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 okay in, in invisibility it's like this person wants you to be invisible because you're so authentic this person wants you to be invisible because you show the true you you show the real you and you don't give a damn about who feels what about what it's like I'm gonna be me I'm gonna do me I'm gonna be this way but this person wants you to, to simply disappear that's why this person's attacking you and your children and stuff like this and this, to me, this reducing burdens, protect, uh, forgiveness, reducing burdens. Um, this is this is that masculine. This masculine is trying to reduce burdens in their life, but they and they want you to have forgiveness because they know that this person is crazy, basically. This person is mentally ill because this person does nothing but play mind mind games and tricks all day long on their own children, on the masculine, on everybody. And especially you because this person is angry that you live so much in the light. You are so authentic. You are what the masculine wants. 
these karmics have lost their mind. You talking about dealing with somebody's children. Baby, you gonna get it. And I got chills when I said that, okay? Black cat. Fortune meets opportunity. Yeah, this is what's going on. These people are shook because the karmics are shook because you're, you, you're having a lot of fortune and opportunities that come your way. They could never be you because the thing is you don't envy anybody. You don't sit around and do black magic on people's children and on their jobs, on their careers in order to, 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 to get what they want out of life. You don't worry about other people to get what you want. You focus on you, spirit. You better speak because you got me itching and you got me tingling everywhere. Come on, spirit. Yes, death. The eternal cycle begins here. Some of these people, children, are going to die. I am so sorry, Lord. I don't want to speak on it. I don't because I, I don't care if it is a karmic child. I feel like all children are innocent because they were put here. Um, that they, they didn't know. But somebody's child is about... Hmm, I'm not even going to repeat that. But there is something going on. Somebody is trying to hurt your child. But in the process, their child is going to be hurt. That's why you don't play with this black magic. Because when you call on Papa Legba... When you, when you call on Ogun, when you call Oshun, when you call Oya, Yemiya, when you call them, when you call them, be ready. Be ready. And when you call them, be, I'm telling you, you can call on all these deities and I promise you some have, all of them have good and bad in them. You cannot mess with them. You can't mess with their child either because the deity that you may be calling on may be I see Oshun right here. She don't play about children. And I'm going to tell you something about Miss Oshun. Oshun, she loves kids. She loves honey. She's very fertile. She loves fertility. But you mess with the child of hers, I promise you. And Oshun and I are tight. So you mess with my children, baby, you're going to get it. So I'm just letting you know right now. Stop. I can't tell you what to do. These comments, y'all know. Y'all better, okay? Graveyard. Graveyard. Unnecessary fear. Death. Grave. Spirit is telling me right now that if you're scared about what these comments may do to you and your children, don't be scared. Because these people have death on them. These people have death on them. Lord have mercy. And people are going to start dying in these people's lives by the threes. By the threes. Three at a time. Oh my God. Unnecessary fear. The, de the, in the eternal cycle begins here. Why are you trying to put somebody else in their grave doing all these tricks and treats? Watch the grave you digging for yourself. That's all I can tell you. Watch it. Ghost regret. You will regret it, karmics. You will. This is a message for the karmics all day. You will regret it. Lord have mercy. But look at this. This woman is dressed in white. She thought she was fooling spirit. But spirit came and said, okay, watch this regret. This one, look at this photo. Look at it. And I said, photo, somebody ancestor is here because photo is not even a word I use in 2021. I have never used photo before. Come on, somebody's ancestors is here talking. Yeah, the future, the veil has been lift. Spirit has shown me to I look straight through the veil. I look straight through the veil. And the future. I can see the future. She is shocked, y'all. Look at her eye. I'm shaking. She's shocked. Her eyes. I'm trying not to shake. But her eyes are rolled in the back of her head. And she's shocked that Spirit even knew what she was doing from get-go. Like Spirit don't know what's up. Come on now. Come on now. Happiness in our hearts and homes. Heart. This is what you're going to experience. You're going to experience happiness. 
regardless because at the beginning of this at the beginning of the read spirit already told you you have infinite possibilities okay spirit already told you it's because you were authentic and you, you in your inv in invisibility you're so authentic it made you invisible to other people and, and but and people wanted to off you yeah but guess what fortune meets opportunity fortune meets opportunity spirit said okay you want to go there you want to play these mind games with my collective and their children okay you need to ask for forgiveness for that you need to ask for forgiveness in the event that you can't my, per my, my collective is going to keep taking risk and reward to get what they want. You're going to keep trying to create things through the ashes, doing dark magic and things of that nature. Baby, death is upon you when you keep doing it. You will end up in the graveyard along with your children. Y'all going to die by the threes, okay? Midnight and go. Okay, you want to play these tricks? You want to play these tricks? Spirit is about to send ghosts to these people's houses. Finna run them crazy. Finna run them crazy. Because you playing with the future. You playing with somebody I gave some gifts to. You playing. You playing, but not today is what Spirit said. Not today. Look at this. Because I'm, I'm creating a strong spiritual being within you. The light after the darkness. What? Look at this. Community and web and weaving. This person was trying to keep you in a web of lies. A web of trauma. A web of a drama. They tried to keep you in it, but it's not going to happen. These karmics are about to fall, and they're about to fall hard. And Spirit said, look, Lady De, La, uh, De, De Los Mutros. Lady De La Mutros. I can't say it, y'all. But this is acceptance and equality. You have to accept what you put out here. And I'm about to make it equal. That's what Spirit said. This is the Lady of Death. And most of this stuff is going to start happening in the winter time, y'all. Intuition on fleet. Scrying. Intuition. Clarity. I just gave it to you. I am done with this reading. All right. I got to clear my energy. I love y'all. Uh, 1727. As I say that, you all have a good day. Bye.